Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today for another Dollar Tree haul. These are going to be Easter gift basket ideas as you all probably know. Um, I have the three-year-old little girl which I love and adore. Some of you were asking me to do Dollar Tree Easter gift basket ideas so I figured why not? I'm sure we could all use a little bit of help or a little bit of ideas, tips, tricks, suggestions, whatever it is, whatever you want to consider it. But I'm so excited, you guys. I love Easter baskets just as much as I love the Christmas stockings. They're amazing and I find them to be very similar. So I'm always thinking about like what to stuff those little eggs with. Leilani loves to open up those little surprise eggs and I figured I could make my own from Dollar Tree so I hope that this video is helpful um, and it gives you guys some ideas and tips and tricks and whatnot. Look at her little basket. This little unicorn basket comes from Burlington Coat Factory. I thought it was so precious. I believe I still have the tag on it. It was $8.99 from Burlington Coat Factory. They had some really cute Easter baskets. And I just fell in love with this one and Leilani didn't want to let it go. She like was holding on to it the entire time we were at Burlington. And I love that store too. Such amazing store to find some really good finds. So I'm going to show you what is in her little basket. I kind of started filling it. It's not 100% filled. I was wearing a hat so I apologize my hair looks a little crazy so we've got some crayons they have the Crayola brand at the Dollar Tree right now so you get 16 little crayons for a buck she also loves puzzles and these are the Hatchimals these are the little Hatchimals puzzle I love when they come in their own little tins or their own little reusable bags or just anything or where it's going to be easy for us to store. The boxes aren't really practical. Um, the puzzles that come in little boxes, but I mean, they still work. It's just really hard for us to kind of keep those nice and organized. So I recommend little tins or little reusable bags um, they have at the Dollar Tree. She also picked up this marshmallow gummy lollipop. She just doesn't know it's going in her Easter basket. We got her some peeps and she chose the color yellow. These little eggs you get a bunch in a bag for a dollar and they've got like little candies inside that are already pre-filled for you guys so it makes your job slightly easier. I also added some little socks. These are so adorable. You get three pairs for only a dollar. These are amazing, especially for older kids as well. You can always, you know, stick them in their little Easter basket. Everybody needs socks. I also stuck these little hair ties in there for her. She loves these and these are amazing. They're clasp free ponytail holders. You get 30 for a buck and they're by the Basic Solutions brand. We highly, highly recommend them. They're awesome for her hair. I also got this little tin in they had a whole little section for Easter basket fillers. But this was in that little section and it says wild and free and it has two little unicorns. And I'm going to go ahead and put little markers in here for her to use when she's coloring. I also got her these um, grab a bubble bubbles last and last stick them and stack them. I thought that was a really unique concept so I wanted to give that a shot for her and she loves bubbles you guys. I got her some of this Flarp Noise Putty. They had different colors but I just went ahead and grabbed her the pink one. They have all sorts of things you guys. Slime. You guys know how big slime is and how much people or kids love it. People too. Anybody. But they have a bunch of slime at the Dollar Tree. Um, these are alphabet flashcards and she loves um, when I kind of test her on like her different animals and stuff, her shapes, her colors. So I grabbed her that. I also grabbed her a bunch of Play-Doh. This one is already in their 
by the Play-Doh brand in pink. They also had Easter stickers. She is a huge fan of stickers and this comes with a bunch. 256 to be exact. So that's perfect for an Easter basket. She's also obsessed with unicorns and I found her this little notebook so she can go ahead and doodle and whatever she wants to do with it. The little glasses are Velcro and that's how the little notebook opens and closes. It is so darling, you guys. Super cute for the unicorn lover. She also wanted these little stickers for her nails and they are Minnie Mouse. She's super cute. So I had a you know, she's got to have this for Easter. It's so adorable and it's only a dollar. She also picked up a cool spinner. This is from 99 cent store, just FYI, but I did throw it in there already. And then these are the magic towels. So she is a huge sky lover from Paw Patrol. So she got two of these and if you got them wet, they like expand. And then she also went to the circus recently and they had cotton candy so that's like her new obsession cotton candy and um, she picked up a little tub of that but she doesn't know mommy's putting it in her Easter basket okay let me show you the rest of the gift ideas that I have for you guys all from the Dollar Tree I have a whole bag right now they have these Crayola play-doh this one is called granny smith apple this one is called Tickle Me Pink, Outrageous Orange, Blue Sky, Tiny Toad Brown, and I think those are the only colors I picked up, but they did have a different shade of blue. They had white and... Um, they had like a red one. More peeps. Um, I think these are going to go in the coffee bar, but those are awesome for, you know, an Easter basket. Another thing of cotton candy. I thought this would be super awesome for either a boy or a girl's Easter basket. It's um, a little bug catcher play set. So they could, you know, play with the ants or whatever. Um, I thought that would be kind of fun. And they, you know, she could feel like she's discovering and you know how that is when you were a kid. I'm sure you enjoyed to do similar things. It's got the little um, tool to pick up the item so that she can stick it in the little container there. Super practical, right? I thought that was an amazing find. We went to Legoland recently, so she's like really into Legos lately. <laughs> and she picked up this cup, the little straw. They had yellow and green and red, and um, I thought those were awesome. Some had them. Um, I went to a couple Dollar Trees. Some Dollar Trees had these in the toy section, and the other Dollar Tree had these in the party section, so I'm not sure where they're supposed to go. I don't know if they should be in the kitchen section, but that's where we found ours, um, and I wanted to share that with you guys. Talking about Legos, she also found this actress and doctor little, their little Lego figurines. This is a great deal because Legos are not cheap, but if you go to the Dollar Tree, they are. I got these Easter eggs, so I got these pink ones and I got these carrots. I'm going to be filling these up with goodies and stuff, so I got these little Easter crayons, so I'm going to put some little crayons in these just so that she can open them and she can be like super surprised and whatnot. But you could put all sorts of things. You could put Dollar Tree has clay. Um, I, th I think those would be awesome to stick in the little carrots or whatever, the little clay. Those would be awesome. I picked up a couple of these. These are the Silly Putty. I'm going to stick those in the bunnies. So I got yellow and pink. I'm going to be sticking those in there. Those are going to be so fun for her to open. I also got this ceramic painting set. I don't know that that'll fit in the egg, but um, 
you know, I thought that was super precious. I also got her this slime. I got a red one and a green one. She's already using the red one though, so that didn't make it to her Easter basket. <laughs> she got a bunch of bubbles. Those are amazing for a dollar, you guys. You get two for a dollar. They also have bigger containers if you want to make a gigantic Easter basket. She also got more Legos in here. How amazing for girls or boys. This is in a shape of a car. Those would be awesome for an Easter basket. And then she picked up some Minnie Mouse bubbles. And then let me show you a couple more things here. Got her some art brushes. These are awesome, you guys. These are little, um, what do you call them? Paint with water books. So you just basically paint this with water and they're gonna have so much fun, you guys. This one here is Lisa Frank, so I fell in love with this because that's like my childhood in a nutshell. This one has got like giraffes and like animals and stuff. Those are so fun. I got this for me. Large print word hunt. It's not supposed to be in this haul, but that would be an amazing gift for like, uh, you know, an adult Easter basket. Um, I love teaching her, you guys. If you don't know, I wanted to be a teacher. That's what I was going to school for. Like I wanted to be a teacher, especially to little little kids and stuff. And um, that's why I love teaching Leilani. So I buy like all of my teaching stuff at the Dollar Tree and I have so much fun because it's something that I thought I was gonna do and I didn't end up doing that. Um, I actually switched my career path entirely. Um, but um, I still kind of teach in a way. It's just different. It's not like little kids like I imagined. But um, this one's for numbers and it does say pre-K here. I want to teach her how to, you know, tell the numbers apart. I really want to focus on that. And then I also want to teach her how to start writing and stuff. So this one is alphabet write and wipe. So with you can use those um, dry erase board markers. But I want her to start to know like how to write A, B, C and how to tell them apart. So I got her the numbers and I got her the letters. We're gonna have so much fun. And then I also got her these, uh, she loves the sticker books. And I just really enjoy teaching her. She's really good with her colors. She's good with her shapes and her animals. Now I want to really focus on the letters and the numbers because those are super important. Yeah guys, those are some of my Easter basket Dollar Tree ideas. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope this video was helpful. Don't be afraid to make your DIY Easter goodie eggs, you guys. You can go to the party section. They also had like yo-yos and stuff like that. Especially if you have multiple kids. I think the little yo-yo pack came with like six of them. So you can stick little yo-yos in the little Easter egg. Uh, they had princess little wands and rings. Those would be awesome in the little Easter egg. They would totally fit in a little carrot one. So I wanted to come on here and share what I had in mind. I'm going to be sticking these in little eggs and also the little bunny crayons. Let me know if you have any ideas down below. We can all share together um, if you've done kind of like DIY Easter surprise eggs for kids. I'd love to know kind of what you have in mind, especially if you have children. We could all share down below. So thank you for watching. Subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the notification so you're notified as to when I post a video. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye guys.